was just going to be you. So did I. Our head is number 220. God, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. To God who is, who was, and who is to come, now and forever. Amen. Alleluia. Almighty God, whose will supreme made oceans light with life to deem, hide in the firmament to fly, and part in ocean depths to lie. Appointing fishes in the sea, and fowls in open air to be, that each by origin the same, its separate dwelling place my claim. Grant that thy servants by the tide, of blood and water purified, no guilty fall from thee may know nor death eternal undergo. Let none despair through sin's distress, be none puffed up with boastfulness, that contrite hearts be not dismayed, nor haughty souls in ruin lay. O Father, that we ask be done, through Jesus Christ, thine only Son, who with the Holy Ghost in thee do live and reign eternally. Amen. I guarded them, and not one of them is lost. I lift up my eyes to the mountains, from where shall come my help? My help shall come from the Lord, who made heaven and earth. May he never allow you to stumble, let him sleep not your God. 
No, he sleeps not nor slumbers, Israel's God. The Lord is your God and your shade, at your right side he stands. By day the sun shall not smite you, nor the moon in the night. The Lord will guard you from evil, he will guard your soul. The Lord will guard your going and coming, both now and forever. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and, and to the Holy Spirit, to God who is, who was, and who is to come, now and forever. Amen. I guarded them, and not one of them is lost. <laughs> that which we have seen with our eyes, we proclaim to you. To you I have lifted up my eyes, you who dwell in the heavens. My eyes, like the eyes of slaves, on the hand of their lords. Like the eyes of a servant on the hand of her mistress. So our eyes are on the Lord our God, till he show us his mercy. Have mercy on us, Lord, have mercy. We are filled with contempt. Indeed, all too full is our soul, with a scorn of the rich, with a proud man's disdain. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, to God who is, who was, and who is to come, now and forever. Amen. That which we have seen with our eyes, we proclaim to you. The river of life-giving water flowed from the throne of God. God is for us a refuge and strength, a helper close at hand in time of distress. So we shall not fear though the earth should rock, though the mountains fall into the depths of the sea. Even though its waters rage and flow, even though the mountains be shaken by its waves, the Lord of hosts is with us. The God of Jacob is our stronghold. The waters of a river give joy to God's city, the holy place where the Most High dwells. God is within, it cannot be shaken. God will help it at the dawning of the day. Nations are in tumult, kingdoms are shaken. He lifts his voice, the earth shrinks away. The Lord of hosts is with us. The God of Jacob is our stronghold. Come, consider the works of the Lord, the redoubtable deeds he has done on the earth. He puts an end to wars over all the earth, the bow he breaks, the spear he snaps. He burns the shields with fire, be still and know that I am God, supreme among the nations. Supreme on the earth. The Lord of hosts is with us. The God of Jacob is our stronghold. 
Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, to God who is, who was, and who is to come, now and forever. Amen. The river of life giving water flowed from the throne of God. We give thanks to you, Lord God Almighty. We praise you, the Lord God Almighty, who is and who was. You have assumed your great power. You have begun your reign. The nations have raged in anger, but then came your day of wrath. And the moment to judge the dead. The time to reward your servants, the prophets, and the holy ones who revere you, the great and the small alike. Now of salvation and power come, the reign of our God and the authority of his anointed one. For the accuser of our brothers is cast out who night and day accused them before God. They defeated him by the blood of the Lamb and by the word of their testimony. For love, love for life did not deter them from death. So rejoice, you heavens, and you that dwell therein. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, to God who is, who was, and who is to come, now and forever. Amen. We give thanks to you, Lord God Almighty. From the first letter of Peter. Let your love for one another be constant, for love covers a multitude of sins. Be mutually hospitable without complaining, as generous distributors of God's manifold grace. Put your gifts at the service of one another, each in the measure he has received. The one who speaks is to deliver God's message. The one who serves is to do it with the strength provided by God. Thus, in all, in all of you, God is to be glorified through Jesus Christ. Mode 8. Sieg et hos, cum fecerit his omnia, que, que preceptas un fobis digite, 
servi inutiles humus, quod ebuibus facere fegimus. My soul proclaims the greatness of the Lord, my spirit rejoices in God, my Savior. For he has looked with favor on his lowly servant. From this day all generations will call me blessed. The Almighty has done great things for me, and holy is his name. He has mercy on those who fear him in every generation. He has shown the strength of his arm. He has scattered the proud in their conceit. He has cast down the mighty from their thrones and has lifted up the lowly. He has filled the hungry with good things and the rich he has sent away empty. He has come to the help of his servant Israel, for he has remembered his promise of mercy. The promise he made to our fathers, to Abraham and his children forever. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, to God who is, who was, and who is to come, now and forever. Amen. Seek at once, confeccionities omnia, quid recepta sun fobis digite, Servi inutiles humus, quo debuibus facere fecimus. Let us joyfully cry out in thanks to God the Father, whose love guides and nourishes his people. Kyrie eleison, Kyrie eleison. Blessed are you, Lord, for you graciously called us into your holy church. Keep us within the church until death. Kyrie eleison. You have given the care of all the churches to Francis our Pope. Give him unfailing faith, lively hope, and loving concern. Kyrie eleison. Grant the grace of conversion to all sinners, and the grace of true repentance to all men. Kyrie eleison. You are willing to live as a stranger in our world, be mindful of those who are separated from family and homeland. Kyrie eleison. Pray for Father Nathan, Father Gabriel Maria, Father Francesco, for all those who ask for our prayers, especially for Anna and for a high school student who died of cancer recently. To all the departed who have hoped in you, grant eternal peace. Kyrie eleison. Our Father, who, who art, art in heaven, heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy, thy kingdom come, come thy, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. And forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, 
but deliver us from evil. Let us pray. Lord, we thank you for guiding us through the course of this day's work. In your compassion, forgive the sins we have committed through human weakness. We ask this to our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. May Almighty God bless you, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Go in the peace of Christ. Thanks be to God. May the divine assistance be always with us. And also with our brothers and sisters. Martyrology of October the 11th. In Thebaid of Upper Egypt, the year of the Lord 357, Saint Sarmatus, a disciple of Saint Anthony, who was put to death by the Saracens. He had said one day, I love better a man who has sinned and now recognizes his sin and done penance than a man who has not sinned and believes he is just. The year of grace, 1592, the return to God of St. Alexander Soli, Dean of Theology in Pavia, Italy, and then Second Superior General of the Barnabites. He was called to the bishopric of Illyria, where his untiring zeal for the clergy and the people merited for him the title Apostle of Corsica. In Rome, the year of the Lord, 1963, the heavenly birth of St. John the 23rd, Pope. Angelo Giuseppe Roncalli was the third of 13 children born in 1881 at Soto Il Monte, Italy. Ordained a priest in 1903, 1904, he eventually entered the diplomatic service of the church, serving in Bulgaria, Turkey, and Greece. In 1944, he was appointed nuncio to France, and then in 1953, he became the Cardinal Patriarch of Venice. On October 20th, 1958, he was elected to the Chair of Peter. He called the Second Vatican Council that opened in October 11, 1962. However, he was not alive to see its completion since he died in, on June 3, 1963. Pope Francis canonized together with Pope John, Paul, John the 23rd, Pope John Paul II on April 22, 2014. Elsewhere, the heavenly birth of numerous other saints whose names are inscribed in the Book of Life.